In the Gilco Beach murders case, a key piece of evidence arrives on Long Island. CBS 2's Jennifer McLogan reports investigators are going way back in the suspect's life to try to piece together this case. According to State Park's records, the serial killer suspect was a seasonal worker at Jones Beach when Rex Heurman was in his late teens and early 20s, less than a 10-minute ride from Gilgo Beach where bodies of young women were buried. You would think it would be someone who was familiar with the area, so someone who either uh, spent a lot of time on Ocean Parkway. Knowing that he's not on the street anymore, I hope that the families can finally get some closure. So far, Rex heuerman has been linked to three murders, is a prime suspect in a fourth, but the remains of six others were discovered near here, too. Relatives of other victims found along the beach are still awaiting answers. There is frustration, but still holding out hope. There's still an awful lot of investigation that has to be done to fully understand how many people were victims to this individual. Meantime, Google Street posted this shot of Heurman's vehicle from 2011 in front of the house. There is growing anxiety among some in Massapequa Park. Guns, one after another, with 200 and a grenade. Next door neighbor Etienne Devalier said his wife caught Heurman peering over the fence at her sunbathing. Devalier told him to cease and desist. He he complied and he didn't he didn't argue back and he didn't fight and he didn't get the uh, violent or uh, I never seen a streak of violence in the guy another neighbor a former police officer described on a podcast how he was confronted by Huerman two weeks ago aboard the LIRR over where he was standing it's almost like a road rage without the car I walked away but he's physically intimidating in the back that he's six foot five missing his left front tooth his voice is very distinctive I, I thought he was a bully I've always thought of Long Island as this Safe haven sanctuary, and like this is like whoa. Pureman, an architect, pleaded not guilty at his arraignment. Police say his wife and two children were in the dark about his double life. On Long Island, Jennifer McLogan, CBS 2 News. We have continuing coverage of this investigation on our website. There you can find more information about the suspect's past and more details, all at CBSNewYork.com.